instead of the cautions given by Baba to Dharmarao. The, 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 you know, the just a car that entered like this and bounded and bounded like this. It just gave a trip. Nobody hearted. You know, Baba at once came out and, and opened his shirt and telling me that I am not hurt anywhere. See, see, but that fellow is hurt anywhere. Afterwards, Dharmaranayad is there weeping and saying namaskars. Baba, I have done nothing and I do not know what happened. He, do, he does not know that the, he is driving the car and the car went to accident. But he told that he was sleeping and something has been done in the sleep and he is, came afresh. That is what Dharmara Naidu told. Afterwards, Baba asking others, other, others all to go, come out of the buses and asked everybody, is safe or not? Are you safe? Are you safe? Are you safe? Then, after watching himself that all are safe, he then after to travel, proceed, proceed further. But the next, another important thing, 1954, is that, that we are camping at Kovo. In the meanwhile, in the, at, uh, in the morning, at 9 o'clock, Baba stepped the bun. He, he, he has selected the highest place on the bun highest place on the one and keeping his feet like this. Yerach brings some water. Yerach brought water. He asked then Yerach to wash his feet there. Yerach washed his feet. Afterwards, the Godari was in flight and touched the spot where Papa has washed his feet. Until then, it has not receded. He touched the spot where Papa has washed his feet and then receded. Then we wrote to Baba, Baba, Vadari has touched that level where you wash the feet. That is, it is, it is, I know it. It was done according to me. That is, afterwards, when we are coming, there was no petrol. After uh, everybody forgot uh, the petrol in the tanks of the like, uh, convoy. After the, uh, we reaching, we left the medical wall and reaching Yarnagodam. Somebody told Baba there is no petrol at all. Baba told us, uh, let others do not hear it. Let others do not hear it. That is the word Baba told. And after that, they Baba, Baba said to Yerech, Yerech, wash my feet. And Baba stood at that time at a high level on the Godavari pond. But then, ba oh, then Yerech brought one <coughs> basket, I mean, bucket full of water and uh, washed the feet of Baba. Afterwards, when the Godavari was in flood, the Godavari, the flood's water touched the place where Yerach washed the Baba's feet and then receded, though steps were taken by the government to get received the flight. That is the, the, word, the act of God. It was written to Baba. It was asked by me to ba Baba, you know, the Godari has touched, yes, I know it. It is done by me. That is what Baba told in Mehrabad. Afterwards, the convoy was coming, when the convoy was coming, in Masuli Patnam, Masuli Patnam, there is a very good incident. One poor teacher, one poor teacher by Surya Narayana. Were you there? Yes, I am the man. Baba asked me to tell, he locked the door, he closed the door and gave me charge, let nobody enter. 
let you know what he had done. At that time, a person has come. His name is Sunarana. His wife was sick. He prayed Baba. He was very poor. He got nine children. And he is unable to come. The headmaster has not given him leave. At he came, he wants to see Baba. He has not taken food. But Baba asked me to close the door. And nobody should enter. I am at the door. What have I to do? Then to say to Baba, Baba, somebody has come. I am. I was ordered not to move from the door. In while we are talking, Balnathu has come. Balnathu, this is this is the position. And this fellow has come all the while from so many places by walking. See his feet. And we, he is not asking. Baba he is not permitting anybody to enter. All right, let us wait for some time and leave to Baba. What Baba will do? Afterwards, Baba passed for 15 minutes. Baba called, you come here. Anybody has come for me? Baba, one teacher has come and he, he wants your darshan. Do you think that fellow is deserving to be given darshan? Baba, it is left for you. How can I say? So open the door. By opening the door itself, that fellow, that brother Sundarayana, began to weep bitterly, bitterly. He wept like anything. Baba stood from his chair and self, that I being the so much great personality, came to Mehrabad with so many difficulties, and Baba has not recognized. So on I thought with this simple mind. At that time, Nana came out from his tomb and called my name, Ponachandra, Baba is waiting for you. So I thought my foolishness and at once asked Baba, excuse. And I repented myself for my silly act and I prayed with Baba. Whenever I want to go, when I, when I have not been to Mehrabad even, Baba, on the 31st January, he actually gave me darshan and told me, when I am with you, why do you want, why you are still weeping? It is I that stopped, but not yourself stopped it. Everything is being done according to my will, but not your wish. That is, so, Baba, I feel Baba is filled in the universe. Whenever I find a lover of Baba, I see that Baba is in that form, is coming, but not so and so, so, so by in person. I wrote a letter to Mahal Mai about my ill health that I am unable to travel and uh, I may be pardoned. Then a reply has come. Don't worry yourself. You will, by seeing the reply and the photo in it, all my fever, which is making me to rise even from bed for the last 21 days, has gone. I, Baba's impersonal aspect <laughs> that worked in the mandali. In the year 1951, the same power with multiplied, multiplied, multiplied power is residing, uh, is staying in that is Mehrabad Samadhi. That is how I feel. Whenever Baba is touching or embracing or blessing, even in the human form, how he has done. Likewise, uh, I feel that Baba in that impersonal aspect also is blessing and uh, I mean embracing and all these things. When I, in the year 1954, Baba has been pleased to, to convey Baba Lover meeting of, at Rajamindri. In that meeting, Baba declared that this meeting was not being held or conducted by God since thousands of years back 
and to the greatest meeting. In that meeting, one, one person has accused the Baba and cut chief with his sweat and uh, asked me to keep it as his prasad. And then he also had a photograph with us. He himself asked us to have a photograph with us and we had this photograph. I am Mr. Ponatadara speaking from the city of Failur. When I met Baba on 25th, 24th night for his birthday at Thade Paligudam at 11.30, I find that Baba in the room was a big light and some kind of lights, spirits, lights were entering. Eric and Krishna was there. Pendu was somewhere, then Baba saw me and told, Eric, send him out first. If not, that fellow will become mad. So, according to Baba, that's, I came out of the bungalow. In the same year, 1954, 30th September, when we are at Mehrabad, Baba told me that in, uh, by doing small things, you brought this avatar down to your level. And when I am with you, why do you fear? And he actually told to me, from that day onwards, all my difficulties have been gone, and I was in safe position. Afterwards, I am always doing Baba's work with all my might, and all these things. I have not failed to attend whenever there is a call from Baba to do service, and I find in every act that is being done for Baba, Baba is with me, and Baba is in me, and Baba is guiding before me. In any obstacle even, Baba is there showing me the way. That is what I feel in my life. And afterwards, whenever, when there is a strike, a was strike, when there are no trains to go to Mehrabad, I myself took cycle at this age of 52 to travel to Mehrabad. After traveling 80 miles, one of the executive engineers who has known me so many days back, spared his jeep and took a first class ticket and sent me to Mehrabad. There are many occasions. And after the dropping of the body even, when I went to Mehrabad, with all these difficulties, when my ego started to think some other thing, when I thought myself that I being the so much great personality came to Mehrabad so many discussions has accused Baba that he that he is not the avatar. He is not the avatar. Then I flew into a rage. I being the human flew into a rage and I want to go neck I caught hold of his neck. Baba at once looked at me and told No, no, no. By his gesture of like that, I was made just like tied with ropes. And my, all the, you I mean my mouth, nose, eyes, and hands, all our things, ceased to work. To, and I am blunt like that. Then after seeing Baba like that, I shed tears and that was loose. Afterwards, in that meeting only, Baba has told Judas Iscariot sold him for six pence in his last birth as the shares. And it is no wonder if I am sold now. Don't fear yourself. It is the eye that look that side and this side. And it is I that I have to equal it. 
for which I was born. That's why I am the author. That is Baba's words. Jai Baba, Jai Baba. When we are traveling from Rajamandri to Amalapuram, Maya Bapur Lanka and Kotapeta in the year 1954 before the Andhra tour, the uh, ambassador car that was sitting and driven by Mr. Dharmarao Naidu, assistant engineer, Baba was sitting in that car. You know, Baba, while before starting travel, Baba declared that he was very, very hungry, that he was very, very hungry. And I am in charge of his goods, you know, luggage and all these things. At once I began to search his stove and all these things. In the meanwhile, a poor fellow brought uh, a plate, uh, a plate just like uh, one or two sheets of rice, uh, some dal and all these things to Baba. You know, I am searching for the food, uh, for the utensils to Baba. Chagan Master is there. And uh, Adhika Irani is very anxious to lit this stove and all these things. At once Baba said, told, no, I don't want food, let us start afterwards. So we started. And uh, starting, there no after the floods, you know, floods, the roads were breached. With the travelers, it has become very difficult. You know, Dharmarana is traveling. There was a heap just a stone heap. Baba is telling Dharmara, you should take me very carefully, very carefully. Very carefully you must take me. Instead of the thousands given by Baba to Dharmara, he did. Baba stood from his chair and walked and embraced him. When he fell down on the ground, he lifted him up. He made him to sit, sit and gave some prasadam. How is your wife? How is your third son? How is your fourth daughter? He questioned everyone for who are suffering in his house. Afterwards, when the darshan has begun, to, when he, Baba's visits has begun to certain houses, all the rich people houses have been shown Baba. Baba, it was in the dark, 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 dark at uh, 6.30 or 7. Baba cancelled the program arranged by these presidents and all these things, and he took his own way and went to, to <laughs> in the, a very, very poor man's hut. You know, that poor man is a tabedar working in bricks, masonry. He wants to see him for the last three days. If he comes to see Baba, his coolie, he will lose his coolie. Yes. He loses his job. Yes. He loses his job. He has no money. So he asked his wife to go. Wife has got only one sari. And all the, there are five or six children. If he comes, he, he, she will also lose. They are in such a plight. So Baba, you know, all the while in the dark, in that darkness, we traveled, we traveled, traveled and reached this small hut. At once, you asked everybody to stay 30 feet to, 32 feet distance to Baba. 32 feet, then I saw Baba light. Baba is with power. That is real Mahar Baba. That is, with that power he entered the house. Then they are taking food, you know. All the poor people sat together and what they have cooked, placed there and all, each in turn they are taking one one morsel. By, by seeing Baba, that machinery began to weep like anything. Don't fear. I have come. When you are unable to come, I have come. You know that he is suffering from asthma from 10 or 12 years. Baba gave him a planting and asked him to take it. From that next day onwards, asthma was gone. You know, he was put into much better position. He, now he got married his three daughters and all the 
fellows now they are very happy in that Masli Patnam. From Masli Patnam, we came while we are coming to Elur uh, at in the midnight Gudwara. Midnight at the midnight Gudwara, you know. Baba. Midnight at the midnight Gudwara, you know. Baba actually at 12 o'clock entered into a cool drink shop. Cool drink shop. He then asked to prepare dracha, dracha, that one kind of drink. And uh, grape juice, grape juice, I mean. And he called. I remember that Jesus Christ giving all his disciples, you know, on that night, sitting in that chair, you know, he gave grape juice to everyone. Adi, Erat, Pendu, Maharji, Gustaji, then Gustaji was alive, and to anybody, ah, to all of the members, he gave one by one, one by one, one by one, and missed also for any other person who has missed the call and gave it in that then. Then we were brought to Yeluru. Well, after coming to Yeluru also, he has been to very poor lovers' houses to whom these secretaries and presidents are not enlisted that to be visited by Baba to those houses. There are so many things to be told to by Baba. And any, uh, one day, I was asked to bring a card. Baba is alone. Yes, Baba is alone there. And I took the card and entered in Baba's room. You know, I I am made to take uh, to another world. You know, my limbs have been you know, seized to stop. But uh, I stood with a the card there, you know. I don't know uh, how to do and what to work. How to work? Because he is alone there and some kind of power is pervading. That power made me non-stop, non-plus. And he is looking at me. Then he gave, after one minute, he gave me a slap on my head. And uh, at one fierce came. Why, what are you taking, you know? What are you looking at, Baba? He then lifted the cart and told, afterwards I felt that some kind of power, power, that came, some kind of power that is pervading around Baba and from Baba, emancipating from Baba, has also entered in me and it is also lying with me on that day because we both united there, united there on that night. That is how I felt. Yesterday, Yerich, brother, Yerich has confirmed it. What was happened between me and Baba last night? I am feeling all these pains and all these things. Yes, something happened, you take rest, it will come to know. That is there. Baba told like that. You know, Baba one day asked, he called me and he gave me to take charge of the bungalow. So he, he, as he is going out to visit the houses, um, uh, others, what he has done, you know, he kept me in the in charge of his samans and all these things, and he went directly to my home, to my, where you know, my wife is staying. And we are living in the small room then. He stayed for ten, ten minutes till the return of my wife with all the mandali members and took Harti and then came away. You know, Baba, whom we thought that he is God and he is only the avatar that we have to adore, 
when we come to that not fight but conception, boy will be salvated from this human bondage. Certainly, certainly, that is my conviction, what I have to say, sir. Jai Baba.